hang out. You definitely need the jacket. It's still winter, Tim, and I'm yeah. just I'm just ready to move past push it, it away. Yeah. Push those mornings, which we're going to have most of the week like this and down in the lower to mid 30s. Still kind of following on radar networks. Johnson, Washington County's a little bit of possibly some light rain right there. Temperatures are pretty cold down there by you in the mid and upper 30s here. That's kind of gravitating off north and east. So a sprinkle. Well, we won't say it couldn't happen uh, if it holds together enough outside, though. We're mainly just watching the little fog come across areas around the river. So kind of step out, look at temperatures that are sitting at the freezing mark right now 32 degrees early cloud cover breaking into some clearing in the afternoon late in the day will lead to some sun kind of mixing in it's a cool start to the week obviously cold in the 20s and 30s we do have an upper 20 to a low 30 mark out there for us upper 50s here so we should stay well shy of that 64 norm what we're going to do though is watch a progression of warmer temperatures come in by the middle of the week at to above average and we'll stay that way here all the way through the end of the week second half is really warm. We're talking 65, 70 degrees. But as of right now, where there's a little bit of some maybe sprinkles down across Sandersville and Wrightsville, mid to upper 30s. Interesting set up right there, isn't it? Temp wise right around the metro, low to mid 30s, about 30, 32 degrees. Five day stretch in the outlook for rain looks promising, doesn't it here? Late Thursday night, very early Friday may be the only shot we have for some light rain as opposed to that little sprinkle coming in some of our southern counties here straight through Tuesday to Thursday. We are going to be dry though, but composite reflectivity kind of gives a little bit of an interesting scenario, doesn't it out there with some moisture coming across parts of Western Emanuel Johnson parts of uh, again Washington County. It's all rain and it has been all weekend down around Florida here. They'd like to see some sun come back in eventually will, but we have a cloud coming cover present this morning that begins to kind of thin out as we move from midday to five o'clock. So maybe look for some sunshine at the end of the day. Middle 50s, upper 50s for us to stuff finish off later today. Morning lows tomorrow are going to be around freezing low to mid 30s clear to partly cloudy skies on and off sunny clouds mixing in as we get through Tuesday there around lunchtime. But a shot at the 60 marks a little bit better tomorrow than what we're seeing for today. Wednesday morning again, we're going to be dipping back down around the freezing mark. So mornings are going to stay on the cold side through Thursday in the mid to low 30s, then 40s and 50s into Friday morning and Saturday. You can see the drop in highs, but look at that 65 to 71 Wednesday, Thursday and Friday afternoon highs cool just a touch around seasonal to above average through the weekend with sun.